Fort Smith, right? Now, when you're 19 years, you know, you're 19 years old. I look back when I was 19, fam. You feel me? A lot of times I thought I was so right about stuff that I was so wrong about. You feel what I'm saying? Like, thought I knew it all to a degree. I think we all go through that at that age. That's that age. And it's a whole new different level when you catch a murder charge and you charge with murder at 19 and you get behind them four walls. You Some of them still be rowdy, but I'm telling you at that nighttime it be eating them up because you be want to live. You ain't live yet. You feel what I'm saying? And so they may get rowdy while they're incarcerated just to, it, you know, just to um, um, put a shield over the hurt. You feel what I'm saying? Now, my man right here is 19 years old. Is charged with the murder of another 19-year-old with a shoot. Had an altercation or whatever. My man got mad, 19 years old, bust a pistol, caught a murder charge, right? Now, it ain't nothing gangster about leaving your family behind. It ain't nothing gangster about having to go do because alleged if he found guilty for these charges, fam, we all know the time that individuals have to do. And a lot of times I have seen I have seen some come out of prison, be reformed and maybe have another chance. Then I seen some fam lose their life. You feel what I'm saying? And lose their mind, you know, in the process. So it don't be no guarantee that an individual going to come out the same way that he went in. You feel what I'm saying? It's a gamble. People die while people are dying on you while you're incarcerated, especially during 20, 30 years. You can expect people like your family to pass. So, hey, man, it's a no-win situation at the end of the day, regardless of what the 19-year-old thinking. Now, he alleged killed this other 19-year-old fled the van uh, burn tried to tried to abandon this car report saying trying to get away from the law which they already know from witnesses that he was the one now if you're not guilty just think now you feel me i'm not talking on nothing to, but i'm just saying to flee from the police on this murder that people saying that you did mean that you didn't want to do it that mean that you didn't want to do it. If, if something happened and you flee from the police, that mean that you didn't want to get caught and go to jail. You didn't really want to do that. You feel what I'm saying? So a lot of these cats, man, be having pistols, be wanting to be gangster, and different stuff like that, but they, but they really don't because they really don't know the consequences behind it. And sad to say, it'd be situations like this be too late. Now, this the dude that was killed or whatever, 19 years old, he might have been out thugging, may have been doing it, might not have been nothing like that. Might could have been a, a good kid. Hey, it don't matter. It's two lives that's gone for no particular reason. These reasons, I'm sick of seeing the family. These reasons don't be for nothing, for argument. And we killing each other, man. The mind frame that we have at this at this young age about um, we we not looking at dudes like brothers. We looking at them like another nigga, especially at that age, fam. Starting to have no love for life or nothing like that. Period. It's not the way to live. That's not the way to live. That ain't what we was put here to do, little bro. Feel what I'm saying? We was put here to be productive. You feel me? In life, get money. It, it, it don't look good when you're catching these murders for petty stuff, fam. People not going to worship you. They're going to talk about you for a minute. That's it. They're going to forget about you, fam. Serious. After about seven years you going down in that system, fam, they're going to forget about you. I don't care how much gangster stuff you was doing out here, fam. It don't matter, bro. You feel what I'm saying? Stop throwing your life away for petty arguments, bro. You feel what I'm saying? It's just not worth it. But yeah, my man, 19, locked up for the murder of another 19-year-old in Fort Smith. But make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm out.